Most people in America are quite familiar with the fact that we have these three P's of personhood, paperwork, and property in terms of our people's rights in the simplest and uniquest of form that makes sense to everyone who is an American naturalized citizen across our great nation. In the terms of our paperwork, we are talking, of course, about the legal aspects of our lives. Our legal name belongs to us, no one else. Anytime someone tries to use or abuse one of our names or one of our monikers or one of our what we call stage names, if you will, if we're an entertainer of some kind, or we have different programs of which we have to keep ourselves aligned and then other parts of our life separate from that. And you know there are a lot of famous Hollywood actors that don't use their real name. But in truth, we're talking about people have the right to the privacy of their lineage, in a way. We're also talking about the fact that our legal name is on all kinds of important documents, from our birth certificate, through our schooling education, through which we have the right to control how that's printed, because it impacts our future work life, our future career life. At the same time, we of course have our legal name within medical records, and we also have our, me our, our legal name within legal situations that are, we presume, lawful. If they're unlawful, then we have the right, if we have the financial wherewithal and means, to correct them, but at the same time, sometimes internal affairs just have to fix things and correct them. But that doesn't always allow for the justification of not paying for someone for the abuse of them. 